Hello everyone, this is Nathan from theebookreader.com. For this video, I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to install apps on the Pen Digital Novel e-readers. So this is the Black Pen Digital Novel. It only runs Android 1.5, so it's not going to be able to install a wide variety of apps. But the White Pen Digital Novel and the 9-inch um, run higher versions of Android, so they can install a lot more apps. The process is the same for each device. So I've got the this one here is straight out of the box. I haven't done anything hardly to it yet. I've set up a couple of things here so that we can move through this a little bit quicker. So the first thing you need to do is set up Wi-Fi. Um, when you first time you do this, you come into Wi-Fi settings, and then it'll scan for networks. You'll hit um, your network. It'll ask you for a password. I already entered mine, so I don't have to do it right there. Once you do that the first time, you won't have to enter your password anymore. It'll just automatically connect when you turn the device on. So um, they have an app store right here. It's um, kind of a minimalistic app store, um, but it works for downloading some apps. Um, they have some pay for apps and free apps up here. One I'd suggest is getting the Dolphin Browser HD. I kind of like it. It's a lot better than the stock Android browser. It's a little more versatile. It's got a lot more features. So it's not going to work on this particular device, but this is the process you do. You just hit download, um, and then you're good to go. You can see up there it's got a little download icon. And as soon as it's done, it will ask you if you want to install it. You just hit install. So like I said, it's not going to work on this one because it runs Android 1.5, but it will work on the other devices. So this um, particular one, it's, um, okay, well, so for Sam, you can come in here and get all your different, um, you get different uh, search options down here and such where you can find different um, apps. So another option, let me show you here on the web, you can download apps from the web. I have another tutorial on my website here. Um, this is a good place to start. So you just uh, go to Google search, hit the ebook reader or the ebookreader.com, whatever, and it'll bring up my website. So for, and you can scroll down. There's this thing down here for the how-to guides. It says installing Android apps. I've already loaded that page. That's this page right here. And it talks about um, some more information on this. So one thing with this Pan Digitals is you don't actually have to use an SD card to install apps. Some devices you do, but out of the box, you can just start installing apps like this. I have some suggestions down here got this Android reading apps pack. Um, it's got a bunch of ebook readers. It's got some PDF viewers and comic viewers in it. You can download that using the browser right here if you want. It's not going to work. The apps aren't going to be compatible with this particular device, but they're all compatible with the white pen digital novel and the 9-inch. And then here's the Overdrive app for getting um, library ebooks. Um, another site, a good site to go to is Android Freeware right here. They got um, a bunch of APK files you download directly. And I'll show you how to do that right here with this YouTube app. I got the page loaded over here. Okay, so here's the YouTube app that I found that works. You need an older app um, because newer ones don't seem to work too well on this device or any of the other Pandora novels. So I got this one set up here. You can go to download it from Mediafire. Actually, I think I might be changing the where this is located. So this process might be slightly different. I'm not too fond of this site right here because you have to wait for the 50 ads to load and then click download here and then it always pops up a pop-up so you usually have to click it again this is actually easier if you do this with your computer um, you can then sideload the apps on here or you can do it like I'm showing you right here so then once it does um, download sometimes you have to hit it twice sometimes you just hit it once um, then you tap on this and it will prompt you to the package installer to open and you can install the app from here And that's how you install apps with the web browser you just uh, tap on the APK files, and then they will start to install automatically once they're once you s click on them, and once it's done, you're good to go. So another way, say you didn't know where that, um, you didn't have tap on it there, you backed out or something. Another way to go into that to your downloads is to open up your file explorer. So it's kind of confusing because it'll say SD card unmounted here. Um, if you don't have an SD card in, even if you do download, it automatically goes to the internal SD card. So you got to navigate to the internal SD card which is, you, it's not that one, you have to come in here to system, so this is actually pretty confusing, system, media, SD card, and then you got to into your, this is the internal SD card that comes with the device, and you get download, this is where your downloads are that you've done with the browser, so like I downloaded that Android reading app, which is a zip file, so if you downloaded that with uh, your pen digital, you just hold on this, and then you'll extract it here, and then you can come in here and install the apps that way. 
just by tapping on them that will prompt the package installer. I think FB Reader, the CFFB Reader will install on 1.5. That's a pretty good reading app. Okay, so um, then if you want to install apps, it's really easy here. Let's wait for this real quick. I had to help it. So if you want to install apps, you go to Settings. Let's go here, Applications. So one thing you also have to make sure, this is set by default, but some if it happens to get unchecked, then you won't be able to install applications from third-party sources. So you got to make sure that that is checked. Then to install apps, you just uninstall apps. You just come in here, find something that you want to uninstall. You don't want to uninstall this newer stuff here. But um, so FP Reader did install. You just tap it and then uninstall. Okay. You're good to go. So sometimes it, maybe you'll get a warning that you have low memory because you have too many apps installed, and that's how you uninstall apps and manage your apps on the Pan Digital Novel e-readers. Um, that wraps up this um, how-to tutorial. Visit ebookreader.com. I'll have some more stuff on there. I'm going to put up a full review for this 1.5 novel if you're looking for that. So um, thanks for watching.